All right. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. We're back with oh, chapter of the Seraphites. So uh, I think those are the cultists. We're back with another session of The Last of Us Two for today. Don't know how long it's gonna be. We'll see. But um. Yeah, I'm excited to get back into this. I think we left off. We were going to the hospital to find Nora. And apparently we're going to be encounter encountering the Seraphites. So that's huge. That's, uh, I guess, the third enemy types. Right clickers, WLF, and now the Seraphites. Hmm. There's a lot of diversity. Well, assuming they play different from WLF. I heard they play different, but I don't really know how. But again, they're AI... Or a human type of AI, so maybe they play the same. Like, I don't know. Hmm. <laughs> so yesterday we found out that, um, Jesse and James, whatever the fuck his name is, he ended up, uh, coming up behind us, and he was doing 18-hour hikes, or stretches, to catch up to us. And that's why he's here, so he left a day after us. And they haven't told him yet that Dina, Dina, Danana, or whatever her name is, is pregnant. So, that's huge. Because I'm assuming it's supposed to be his, right? Because they were the last, like, they were together last. So, that's also huge. I wonder how that reveal is going to go, right? So, without further ado, get these mothballs out of the way. And let's get into the game. Uh, let me take a refresher on what we got here. Five arrows. We've got decent bullet count. I do want to make some more of these mines. Dude, these mines, these mines were so good. Especially for dogs, right? The dogs, oof. The dogs were eating them. They were eating them. I have a melee weapon. I, I think I might as well, right? Don't really use the zizzers too much. Hold on a minute. <sighs> All right, my bad. My uh, my sister was telling me that there's pizza around there, but I just I just ate, so I'm good on that front for now. Although fresh pizza is better than cold pizza, or like you know cool down pizza, so that kind of sucks. But I just started the stream. I'm not leaving the stream now. <laughs> Comics Comics Expo, Seattle Conference Center. I wonder if that's real. I guess the thing that happens in Seattle or not. Or maybe it's like a, a knockoff of a real expo. Because like LA every year hosts uh, anime expo, you know, before the pandemic. Before the, the Last of Us became real, right? So. Yeah, I was actually going to go this year too to AX with a bunch of my friends. Some of my old roommates from ASU, but. You know. COVID. My name is Cove. Go C to the O V, the CEO of the R O C. Couple places to go, huh? I don't really know which way. I'm assuming this one leads outside, so let's open this one. No, huh? It's just locked. Huh. Oh, it's windows. Cool. Really? I have to shoot it? I was gonna make another batch of arrows anyways. So it's not even that big of a deal. Let's see. I was about to say nothing, really? I just fucking shot a bullet for you, man. Arch enemy trading card. Ooh, he looks cool. 
seeing here. Uh, Arch enemy, real name Marcus Fordham. Brain 60, Brom 60, affiliation none. A former army, or former army, army sharpshooter in season bow hunter. This vigilante's path was forged when his family was caught in the crossfire between New Dock and Society of Champions. As told by grief, he turned into the most dangerous game. Not human, but superhuman. Donning high-tech camouflage and claiming the moniker Arch Enemy, he's menaced both sides of the war with his hunter's instinct, compound bow, and personal <clears throat> an arsenal of high-tech traps. Neutral villain. Okay, so he's he's not on any team. He's just like fucking with both of them. That's pretty funny. Okay. So 12 is the limit for the revolver, huh? Well, if it lets me come back here, maybe I can actually, like, pick it up, but I doubt it. This game, like, the one of the things I'd never liked about The Last of Us or The Last of Us 2, which you just kind of saw the dilemma here, right, was, like, I don't want to proceed too far in the story because it'll lock me out of the path to, you know, go again. So, basically, if I would have gone through here first, I'm sure I locked a door and then that would have been unobtainable or I wouldn't have gotten, been able to go through there uh, successfully, right? And that happens a lot throughout the first one, and especially this one, like, from what I've seen, it gets bad. In terms of like, oh yeah, you can uh, miss out on a bunch of stuff, or a bunch of side stuff, relatively easily. Because it chunks it up into segments that you can and can't go into, like, a lot. Hmm. But of course, like, if you do a second playthrough... And you already know everything happening, and then you already, you know, you know, well, shit. You know, most of the things that you want to do, then it's just like, oh, okay. Oh, it was a wolf, huh? How can you tell? Patch? Wow, that looks like she got eaten. Uh, yeah. I don't know, I can't really tell that it's a wolf myself. Oh, oh my fucking god! Oh no, oh no, <laughs> that's not the time. Yo, he scared the fuck out of me. This piece of shit. Oh my god, dude. I actually scared the fucking pool nanny out of me. More of all the shots. This guy? Yeah, they got his ass. Hold on. Can't really make anything, huh? Oh, wait, there's six supplements. Oh. I need 60, I think? Oh, wait, that's not the right one. Yeah, 60. I haven't really found that many supplements, so... I don't even know what the fuck that thing was, right? Oh, shit. Like, was it a clicker? Was it a dog? Like, I don't really know. Ew. Oh, shit. Oh, these are stalkers, huh? Yeah, we do, fam. Ah, so I'm assuming because they're quiet, we can't hear them on the, um, the sonar, or whatever the fuck it's called. I'm trying to make sure I don't run out of fucking batteries. Like, um, you know how, like, the flashlight will flicker? And it was flickering at the most opportune time. Come here, bitch. Oh, shit, hey, yo, they're fucking... Fuck. Fuck, oh, yo! Get off me. Oh, yo, I'm gonna beat the fuck up! Oh, wait, there's fucking three of them! Oh, there's like seven of them! Nah, fuck you, bitch! That's right! Dude, <laughs> I see you, bitch, you ain't slick! You want some of this heat, too? Nah, you want the smoke, don't you? Oh, what the fuck? Yo, they're fast! 
There's so many of them though. Like there are so fucking many of them. It's crazy. And they're fast little fuckers. I guess the mine would be good for them too, right? Cause they like, it looks like they like sneaking up on your bitch ass. Oh. That son of a bitch. <laughs> He's, he's fucking camping. He sees bitch ass. He's like, oh, I'm gonna get you. <laughs> so yeah, those fuckers will definitely start scaring me. I don't know where to go, though. She said something about uh, wanting to get outside, and I didn't see anything like that. Talking so. shells are always useful. I don't really know where to go. Uh, there's like one or two still alive, but I have no idea where they are. I should have tracked that one down and killed them just so that he wouldn't like get on me, right? Oh, I guess this is the place. Because the level dictates that they shouldn't follow me. <laughs> what happened? Oh. I don't think I can make that. Oh, it looks like I have to, right? Let's, uh, let's save up. Just in case we fucking throw ourselves into the abyss out here. Harum! We made it. Make this hold six, yeah. Shit, what the fuck? Down to the street. Making my way downtown, stalkers and bound. Gonna cry if they come at me. It's a quick clacker, huh? Damn, break the head while wow, they're coming at me. I'm so scared now. What the fuck was that? Did you hear that? It sounded like some motherfucker just dropped up behind me. Game's making my anxiety shoot through the roof really fast and suck now. So there were two clickers and I only saw one with my vision. So that kind of blows. <laughs> I guess it's just not upgraded enough right out and put points in it to hear them. Make a lot of them or whatever. Oh, they give me a shotgun shell. For dying, I guess. <laughs> They're like, you champ, you need this. I'm just gonna lure them and throw a molly, I think. Molly, 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 let me see you pop that body. Oh, there's a, there's a, there's a clicker right there just chilling. Okay, okay. Alright. <laughs> what is that? Oh, I thought that was something. Through the crowd. What's up, buddy? Oh, there's a motherfucker right there. You saw him? You see the, the fucking... The what's your face coming out of him, though? The fucking... What do you call him? The... Uh, not the spores. The stuff coming out of his fucking face. What would you call that? 
Hey, bitch, pop around that corner again. I fucking dare you. Their type is really weird in this game, huh? Like, they're not really like the one to come fuck you up. They come out in groups. They stalk. So you can't really hear them. And then they do hit and run. Oh, look at that. He came out all killing this fucking troll. He said, oh, I got you now, bitch. <laughs> Oh man, I did a lot of damage too. Fuck you! Die, bitch! Oh, he's right there, you see his bitch ass? Oh my god. The struggling thing takes a lot of health. Why did he, why was he able to throw me? What? This man just said, no, you. He hit me with that reversal in Uno. Oh, fuck. Bitch. I don't know if these are all the guys fucking with me or not. I don't think so. I think there was at least one more. Again, like I said, I can't really hear them though. Gotta see them peeking around fucking corners like... <laughs> they're out here playing Rainbow Six, right? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> out here peeking corners like it's Rainbow fucking Six. No cares in the world. I hear one of them. Like, there's somebody still alive out here. Big chillin'. Oh, fuck, I heard like three of these fuckers. Bitch. Why are you so loud? Silence, they're not silent. Yeah, silence. Okay, so that sounded like, uh, sounded like that was it. Yo, fuck that noise. Did you hear that shit? Sound like someone was running upstairs. Yo, what the fuck? Oh my god, there's like 10,000 of these fuckers. Oh! That's a barnacle boy! Oh, shit. What the fuck? Oh. Nice. Oh, you're done now, son. Yeah, at least he can at the very least swim now, but this is way too much, even for a person who can swim. Torrents, or the, the fucking, what do you call it? The tide is way too strong. Torrent, tide. Shit. Oh, wow, that looked like it fucking hurt, right? Needs to calm down over here. But now I'm in a sewer system. Great, more clicker territory, right? Ew, I'm in sewage water. Can't go up, huh? Hmm. See. What's that? Two by four? Okay. <sighs> Maybe I have to dive under here, huh? No. Oh. 
climb. Alright. Cool, cool. Nice. Oh, got a balance. Oh, oh. prone. All right. Nothing here. Guess not. Okay, I guess we're in the clear. Get me the hell out of here. So we're probably like right outside the hospital now, huh? Let's uh, check our shit before we go any further. I do want to make a silence here. Excuse me. Let's make a first aid kit. Let's make two. Might as well, right? Okay. Alright. I guess let's have the magnum out, or not the magnum, the revolver. We need another half to make another bomb. Gate's kinda creepy, huh? <laughs> the gate's kinda fucking creepy. This one kinda looks like uh the cloudy with the chance of meatball guy. <laughs> Damn, we're still a ways off, huh? Thought we were really close. Like, considering how forward we'd gone, but I guess not. Someone's here. I don't see anybody. I literally just had a feeling, I was like, let me put my silencer on, or let me put my silencer pistol back. And someone whistled. Like, I would have just thought it was a... Wait, is that somebody? No, it's a plant. Uh, I would have just thought it was a bird or something if it wasn't for the fucking, uh... The subtitle saying strange whistle, right? Look, this is bad. We don't know where they're at. I think I hear someone moving. Might be those stalkers, right? <laughs> oh my god, that scared the shit out of me! Oh! My fucking god! Oh! Jesus fucking Christ! I was literally like, dude, there's no fucking way. I was like, dude, there's no fucking way I can get up there with like... Without being in cover. It's people. It's not the stalkers. Like, hey, where'd he go? <laughs> Sounds like a girl. But it can't be Ellie, she's not moving. I mean, yeah, she just got shot. But... Fuck you up. Oh, 
bitch. Get down, get down, get down. Fuck, fuck. That doesn't sound good. So there's a torch bearer over there. Is there someone else still here? They see the dead body. Fuck me, they see the dead body. That arrow coming at me, dude, just scared the fuck out of me. What the fuck? Oh my god, I actually just, ah, oh, I might have some stains on my underwear after that one. Dude, this is a big boy! This is a big ass fucking boy! It's not just me, right? Like, this person's fucking huge! Shit, they see me. You hear that? These fuckers- Oh! Oh! Get up! Ellie, get up! Did you hear that shit, though? They saw me and they were like, we- I'm throwing out gang signs and everything. Fuck. Shit, that was an axe. I should have picked it up. I should have picked it up. I should have picked it up. It's locked. Oh my god. Oh, but this ain't. Oh, they hear me. Oh, they see me, I mean. Hear me, see me, same difference. Fuck me, dude. Yeah, I would say. Hospital. Fuck! This scared the shit out of me. What a save, man. Oh my god, dude. What the fuck? That shit was crazy. <laughs> Just pop. <laughs> God damn, they scared the shit out of me, dude. Oh, I got a two by four. Great. I really should have picked up that axe. I don't know if there's going to be more scars in this building or not, right? Is that weird? I don't know. I don't really know where it is. It sounds like a bunch of birds. Doppelganger trading card. It is. Um, 60 brains, 60 bronze, affiliation none, real name unknown. Strange being of unknown origin, the air, the alabaster, alabaster skinned humanoid with yellow eyes capable of assuming the shape of anyone you need him or her to be. The only catch, you need to make physical contact with the person you wish them to impersonate. The resemblance is near perfect, though if you look closely, you'll see their eyes give a glint of yellow after the transformation. If you ever see a friend wearing sunglasses at an inappropriate time, you'd best be on your guard. Neutral. Hmm. I wonder what's the correlation to the supercard, because, like, the comics, I know had a correlation with, like, you. I just don't remember what it was exactly, but I remember there was supposed to be a correlation. I wonder if the, the the superhero cards have something too, but I mean, from what I've seen so far, not really. It's just kind of like those little collectible things, but you, you never know, right? Because last game it was the comics, and the comics somehow was like tied into what you're doing, but I don't remember how. I remember when I first played The Last of Us in 2013, 
that's when I like found out about like it had some excuse me like some uh, correspondence to what you're doing in the game or whatever okay. uh, some parts I do need parts hmm. nice that should be enough for uh, a bomb if I need a bomb Music got ominous fast. Need a little bit of rag. I can make a third bomb where I can silencer it up. I think we're gonna make a third bomb. Bombs are super good, dude. Oh shit. No, 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 no. I want the scissors. I want the scissors. There we go. Okay, so it looks like we have to go that way, huh? This is the other side that was locked, huh? Nope. 302. Nice. You have 62. Oh, supplements. Nice. Oh, what's this? Oh, a secondary, uh, uh, a small gun holster? Nice, yeah, it was exactly that. If anyone finds this note, my wife Paige is waiting for me back in the old conference center at Pike at and Convention. That sucks. Wife Paige, yeah, I think I remember a note saying Paige. Right across from the brew pub. Please take her this Oh yeah, she was the one that was in that other room where we like it was like a puzzle before we like the first place that we came to. Please take this, uh, uh, take her this medicine. She's pregnant and could die without it. I thought I could make it, but I've lost too much blood. I was sprinting through the woods, heard some whistles, and then an arrow pierced my sides. I ducked into this place, and I think I'm safe. Can't get any worse, right? Starting to feel cold. Stole all this me medicine from the hospital. Should have grabbed some blood, too. Bad joke. Never mind. She'll tell you I'm always making bad jokes. Same, dude. If you find Paige, tell her I went peacefully. Tell her I hope they live happy lives. Tell her I love her. And tell her if it's a boy, don't name the kid after me. Go with the name we picked. Simon Vickers. Fuck, man. So this was the guy that... Because she said, like, oh, like, I'm scared. You know, I left even though you told me to stay. I'm scared. Please come back. And he ended up dying to the, you know, to the fucking... What do they call them? The fucking Theraphites. <sighs> It sucks. Oh, there we go. There it is. I don't have to keep switching between the two. Oh, just to open the door. Well, it's a good thing I came upstairs. I could have completely missed that. That would have sucked. This looks like a story. Why is she running like this now? Cause she's got the holster. Or? Oh my god! You know what it is? She's like she has like quick draw pro on the fucking gun. She was like hip firing it. What the fuck? It's cool, but now she's not. That's some supplies. So take these. Hmm. Take all the bullets I can, fuck. Oh, right, and then we got the, um... Now we can do faster stealth kills, that's perfect. That's, like, half the time, I'm a specialist. Achievement, or trophy earned, specialist. But, um, half the time that something happens like that, like, where I can actually make a, a kill and, you know, try to get away and clean me, I like hesitate because I'm like, wait, it's gonna take too much time. We're kind of out in the open. Someone might see us, you know. So now, hopefully, that gets like dialed back a bit because we have the 100% takedown speed. Looks like something's gonna happen. That camera angle got all wonky.
There are a lot of these fucks. So they do speak. That guy was speaking something about know her love. Is he? Oh yeah, that uh, the fucking what do you call it? The prone speed up a hundred percent is coming in real clutch too. I think we go this way. It looks like. Nice. Oh, I thought that was someone standing. This man's lynched. There were supplies, right? We might as well take them. Get the what? Get the wolf? Oh, they think I'm a wolf. Alright, I guess that makes sense. Ellie is breathing hard. That actually worked. That's good. Cause I was shitting myself after I got caught. How does he know? Looks like we go to the left. Can we do like... No, shit, where, where, where? What the fuck? Dumb bitch. Fuck Sarah. Sarah's a cunt. <laughs> Sarah's a baby back bitch. Oh fuck. I was gonna say it's on Oh shit. Oh he's coming. Oh he's co Oh my god he came. Oh. Oh, well well that happened. That happened. You take bleed damage over time while stuck with an arrow. Get to safety and hold R1 to pull it out. That's crazy, dude. That's so cool, though. So not only... So this other bitch comes up the stairs. And then there's another guy right behind her. Uh-oh. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't mean to shoot again when fucking... Hey, don't they stop snitching? He said he's running. Really don't give up, huh? Tired. 
murder you guys, man. They found me? I used to give you like a visual, or not visual, like an audio cue when they were like, hey, you're fucked. Oh, what the fuck? That's who found me. This bitch coming up behind me. Oh, <laughs> I forgot I still have the 2x4. Oh, shit, 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 shit. They come up, I'm screwed. Someone on my left. He's on my cheek. <laughs> no, you don't. You're no shit. You know nothing, John Snow. Bitch. God, I fucking hope so. They fucked me up good. We can loot this stuff, right? Might as well. Is there stuff in here to loot? Way better than the 2x4. No edible stuff. Feathers, rags. Oops, still need another quarter of a rag, it looks like. Hmm. I know it's going here, I guess. Let's, uh, let's save up. That was a big segment. And we had to cross a lot of shit to get here, right? Bunch of makeup, it looks like. Merci. I guess it's like the Sephora of uh, The Last of Us. No makeup person, but I know the brand. <laughs> Ew. <laughs> Ew. I get out of here. I was gonna say, do I have to get up that truck with those guys? Oh my god! It's a full stroll! Yo. I'm about to pump you full of lead. Bitch. Oh my god! Eat your ass, bitch. Oh fuck me. Oh, I want his Bustroff weapon. I am so fucked. Hey, still we are, bitch. Wolf my ass. That was huge. Huge. I thought that guy was going to be a lot bigger. I was actually contemplating, or like, tougher. I was really contemplating sh shooting him with a shotgun shell. Oh, fuck. It's a good thing he's only human, though. That fucker didn't look human, let me tell you. He was coming at me with the passion. I need another medkit, so... That was a bottle. Uh, I need rags. I'd rather have another medkit than a silencer right now. Oh, I need to refill this. Hold on. Alright. Oops. That's a big ass weapon for Ellie to have. Bustro. I don't even know where I got that fucking name from. <laughs> Just called him the Straw. 
I imagine he's like Slotvian or, or whatever. Slo slot I think Slotvian's the word, right? Those big burly guys are usually Slotvian or whatever. Or Russian. The big strongmen. The strongmen competitions. Let's see. So top blocked again. No, it's not. Hmm. Let's check this out. Scissors, already have scissors. Uh, alcohol, can use alcohol. What's in there? Ah, files. Perfect. Just what I need. Okay, it looks like that's it for this. Okay, that looks like we're we're done with this place after that. So let's go ahead and climb on that little file or whatever. Really? Okay. Guess I'll just climb on that. Oh, we got the rag that we needed, I think. Yep. The good thing our health kits are healing a lot too, because I go from like that first that first bar at the bottom to full with the health kit. What's this? Organic chemistry concepts and practice eleventh edition. Okay. Oh, new upgrade branch explosives. Oh shit. Oh, and this is the last one, so we got all of them. It looks like. Craft explosive arrows. Hold on. Craft arrows with explosive tips that deal massive damage in a blast radius. Press triangle while aiming to change arrow types. Recipe requires explosives and binding. That's sick. Improve trap mines. Craft more effective trap mines that are deadly at greater range. That's cool. Increase Molotovs. Nice. Increase the effectiveness of your Molotovs spreading fire in a wider radius. That's cool. Molotovs are really useful. Craft more trap mines. Increase your efficiency by crafting trap mines, producing more than from the same resources. Okay. Craft more explosive arrows. Craft from 1 to 2. Inventory capacity from 3 to 4. Wow, that looks like the branch I want to do, right? I do love me my throwables and explosives. Uh. Hmm. I don't know, it's tough. Explosives or precision for the next one, huh? I don't know. I guess I'll think about it, right? Don't have to make a decision right now, anyways. Nope. Can we make something? Nope. Could improve this, right? Let's do it. <laughs> nice. Got a big ass burly thing for Ellie. Yeah, let's make some more arrows. We're good now. Cool. Guess we'll stick with this for now since we're dealing with the Seraphites and we don't really want to attract all of them, right? Shit. It's pretty bright. Looks like a... It's right there. Nice. This looks like a place where we're fighting. It's pretty wide. Hmm, I guess not. Okay. I'll take that. Easy street. Don't see anything. Is all wet, lol. Some mafia music. Can't wait to play that remaster of the first game from the ground up. That looks awesome too, especially visually, man. I love the original mafia game, and I played that original one like countless times at least 10 plus and that story is awesome let alone i love the fuck out of that like just the whole vibe of the 60s and 
30s and all that. Dude, I love it so much. Bats Mundar, home planet Neptune, brains 80, brawn 60, affiliation spark. Once the solar system's most notorious pirate, Neptunian Bat Mundar, became known for hijacking resupply ships threatening the nascent colonies on Europa and Enceladus, Enceladus with starvation. Pursued by the future alliance into the asteroid belt, she flew her ship too close to mysterious wormhole and fought herself back in the 21st century. Though she initially enjoyed her newfound superiority, she quickly became frustrated with the limitations of our 21st century technology and sought out Spark. Her offer, her knowledge of the future, in exchange for a way back to her own time. She's a villain. She's got a cool ass red blade. <laughs> Oh, it's a note or something. Oh, it's a combination. Tom, I keep hearing gunfire odd hours. We have no one to protect us in this crazy cult. From this crazy cult. We can't wait for the WLF to find us. We have to trek to their base and join them. I started stashing supplies in the safe, heading out to scout the best route. We'll be back with a plan ASAP. Be careful, MK. Uh, P.S. Almost forgot the code is 385523. I don't know where the safe is, but... 385523. 385523. Oh, maybe it's in there. Oh, supplements. Can't leave those. Let's see. Uh, 38. 25 53 Check again. Is it 25 53 53? Oh, huh. Okay, so I'm just stupid. That's what it is. That's what it came down to. I'm just dumb. Uh, 38, 55, 23. Okay. 38, 55, 23. Okay. Ports, explosion. Oh, nice. Didn't really need that ammo. Oh, I kind of wish it was shotgun ammo, to be honest. That's something we don't find too much of. That was that. Cool, there's a bunch of shit in here. It's a good thing we checked over here, huh? Oh, there's something right there, isn't there? No? And a workbench. We haven't seen a workbench in a minute. And we got a bow. Draw speed, restring the bow to increase draw speed. That's something we kind of need, to be honest. It draws really slow. Rangefinder. Add a rangefinder to automatically mark the distance to the enemies on the reticle. What? I don't really know what the fuck that means. But. Draw speed for sure. Draw speed we need. I think we're gonna do draw speed on the bow. Like, yeah, when I do the Joel stuff that I said, like, you know, tribute. But draw speed, just, we need that, for sure. I'll restring that bow. <laughs> nice. Should I do fire rate? Only two off, right? Like next workbench, I'll definitely have enough, and I'll do stability. I think. Mm 
Alright, we're good. Let's see how it looks. Oh my god! Dude, that's like instant now. Dude, that's so good. Oh my god. Oh, fuck. Dude, that's so fucking good. Now it doesn't take ten fucking years for it to line up, right? That's fucking awesome. Alright. I'm fine with that. Even though it's taking us a little longer to than I wanted to make this gun perfect. We don't really use it too much either. Because we're always trying to be stealthy or whatever the fuck, but we need to start using it. Because I, I just want to, you know, I just want to play it, pay that homage. Upgrade the Joel gun, man. It's something I want to do. I know it doesn't really mean anything, and it's not really like, oh, that's the best way to pay tribute, but that's, you know, that's just what I feel like doing. SWF? Yep. But who escaped? Not me, right? I mean, like, I don't think I escaped these people. my health for it's just gone <laughs> so the WLF seem to have full control of this uh, this hospital which I mean is a good oh this is the part from the E3 thing or the PlayStation State of Play Hotline Miami. Yikes, man. Did you see that agony on her face, like, right when she got sad? Fuck, man. Smoke cap in this game is insane. Yeah. Oh. Uh. Yeah. PS Vita. Well, I used to have a Vita, but I mean, it wasn't like I didn't really buy anything on it. I should have though. Um, when I was like, cause I didn't really get it. Like someone, like just kind of gave it to us. But like, that's where I could have learned my love earlier of Danganronpa because I'm a huge Danganronpa fan and it was like exclusive to the Vita for a while I think let's see here so now it looks like we're gonna be fucking with the w oh yeah the WLF hmm. excuse me you think? Hmm. Oh. What the fuck is the fob? Oh my god! Oh, I didn't. You know what you're talking about.
I dare a dog to come sniff my fucking trail. Did she just call her dog a bear? Oh shit, wait, they saw me, saw me? Wait, why? No one called out or anything. Yo, but did she just call her, her dog bear? Head ass. Like, did she really do that? Because that's one of my dog's name, and that's fucking heartbreaking. Like, zero cap. Like, I didn't name the, my dog, but, you know, my little sister, I think, did. Oh, no, um, we adopted them when they were really young, and, um, from, like, a friend. Like, she was a breeder or whatever, my mom's friend from work. And, you know, they looked like a bear. Oh, what the fuck? They looked like a bear, uh, and then... The other one's got like a mask like a bandit, so we called them Bear and Bandit. No cuties, but damn, that's fucking... That shit shook me when she said, Bear, you got something? He just blows up. Oh, man. Fuck you. <gasps> Who's the man throwing all this shit at me? I don't know what to do, because I hear him scream every time he does... Oh. Oh, what the fuck? Bitch. <gasps> it's him again! Yo! I'm tired of you! Oh, oh wow. She had an agonized face there. <sighs> that sucked. Oh, did I not put the bomb down on this one? Oh, I did. Where? Where is she? Oh, she was behind me? Oh, fuck me. Let her get away. Oh, yo, those two popped me! Did you see that shit? They said, pff, 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 pff. It was over. Yeah, but I do think the dog's name is Bear, and that's fucking... It breaks my heart, dude. It deadass breaks my heart. Right over here. Fuck me! I tried. <laughs> Bitch. What you get? Yeah, Charlotte's gone. Charlotte almost never existed. Ew. No, I didn't. Shut up. Bitch. I can't tell if that's really fast or not. Like, I'm sure it is, right? They said it was, but I don't know. Oh, he's faced over there because I had made a commotion over there. Nice. Cool, cool, cool. There were a lot of people there. That was at least 10 plus, right? Like, that was at least 10 plus. Wow. I knew it had to be somewhere back here because we're trying to go upstairs. But that was tough. Especially if you're trying to do that, like, full stealth without anyone finding out about you. Like, that's got to be insane. Excuse me. I'm sure I missed a couple supplies and shit because I kind of like ran through the back there, but... Oh. 
<sighs> Alright, supply list, must, alcohol swabs, iodine swabs, woven gauze, gauze bandages with, with tape, muslin bandages, latex gloves, face mask, morphine and mal maloxone, bandages, safety pins, gel burn dressing, blankets, if available, intraseous infusion kits, uh, hemostatic dressings, whatever you can find, blood pressure cuffs, antibiotic penicillin, levoflacin, or le 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 levofloxacin, amoxicillin, and whatever you can find, stretchers, since we got them all, trauma shears, rapid application splints, open chest injury seals, whatever's left, tube airway, be sure to dig into the corners of the second floor, there are still some rooms you haven't opened that might have things worth taking, don't go near the lower levels, Sam. Don't go near the lower, lower levels, we're on the lower levels, what the fuck? Yeah, it looks like that's that. Can I repair it? Like, can I just infinitely, infinitely keep repairing this? No, you can only do it once, so. though. I guess that makes sense. This is a one-shot weapon. A huge one at that. Oh, fuck me with the copyright claims, right? So deep, so deep, put a rest to sleep. One, she didn't hesitate. They call Ice Cube the Top Gun. That's a whole vibe, dude. Notion. Worked out. And herself. You're gonna tell us where she went. When Isaac talks to us about this, I'm gonna say what I think happened. That's Nora, isn't it? Yeah. Nora. I'm not going down for her. So Abby left her cell, which I'm assuming is like a branch, like they mean like a branch of their uh, organization, right? Like a cell, not like an incarceration cell. So Nora nor is here confirmed. Nice. Smooth pickings right there from Ellie, that was cool. Cool little maneuver. It's gonna cost us eight years. <laughs> can tell which way we're supposed to go right hold on I'm gonna save here and I, I don't want to miss like extras because I kind of need them right now so we're gonna go through here see if this is extra it is but it's locked there's no way to get over there from what I know so okay never mind looks like we're good Nora yep don't scream Yep, yeah, we got her bitch ass. Put that shit down. Yeah, put that shit down, Nora. Hurry the fuck up and put that shit down, Nora. Yeah, you better fucking purse your lips. You know what's coming. I already got bitch scar. Tommy got that Asian guy with the beanie. Yeah, that's fucking right. You, bitch. You're done now. Oh well. <laughs> Got your bitch ass. Tell me where she went. I'll think about letting you go. I'll think about it. She's reaching for something. Look, she's reaching. Maybe. You should have. Yeah. Yeah, Maybe that's right. Fuck out of Jackson. That's that tell him. Tell him, Ellie. Where's Abby? She's reaching. She's trying to get something. She's taunting you. She's trying to distract you. Kill her. Then why the fuck did you do it? If you have a fucking conscience all of a sudden. What the fuck? Kill him. No. No, we're fucking killing her. Nah, bitch. Nah, fuck you, bitch. Nah, you're coming. Nah, get your ass fucking here, bitch. Oh, you're trying to put a fucking... That's fucking funny. I invented the stretcher. Now I'm putting you in one. Nah, you dumb fucking ho- mm. Nah, we're fucking killing her for that one. 
Uh, this sledgehammer designated for you, bitch. Nah, nah, I don't even care about them. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. I'm coming for you. Beeline for you. Come here, bitch. Now nah, you want to talk all that smack? You want to talk all the good, good? Come here. Oh, where the fuck did you go? Oh, this way. Come here, whore. Come here. Get the fuck here. Fuck. Come on, Ellie. Nah. Fuck you. Put up those. Put up the dukes. Put up the dukes. Yeah, the knife. No. Get her. Fucking get it. Oh, I'm mashing square. I'm mashing square. You can't. Yeah. No. Oh, fuck. You hit me with the right hook. Get her. This fucking bitch. No. No, no, no. We're, dude, I've never matched square so hard. This bitch is getting it. Throw down your weapons. Throw down your weapons in my fucking ass. We're coming for you. Nah. Nah. Nah, you want to talk the smoke. You want to talk the fucking smoke. You gun down. Shut the fuck up! Get back! You have nowhere to go. Get back! You have nowhere to go. Bet? I've gone through sewers before. Clickers are here, right? Oh, spores! Lol. Turn, bitch! Fucking turn, bitch! Mask on! Fucking mask on! No! Come on, man. I'm fucking firing. Have fun. Have fun. Have fun with the clickers. Nora, the sledgehammer's got your fucking name on it, bitch. Put this in here. So this must be the lower levels that that note was talking about. Like the, they just haven't cleared them because there's just so much forage and all that shit, right? Here you coughing, bitch. I'm gonna talk all that fucking trash and then when I come for you to get that head to snatch that weave then all of a sudden oh no please don't kill me oh my god oh please the fuck out of my fucking face oh I guess I just didn't see this turn bitch turn fucking turn Hey, bitch. What's that? I think it's a bad baby song. Hi, bitch. Hi, bitch. Bye, bitch. Uh. Oh. <laughs> yes. Oh, I love this. Oh, I love this. <laughs> oh, yeah. Let's get it. <laughs> Oh, she's still trying? Yeah! Oh, look at her arm. Limp. Where's Abby? Everything's worse. Yeah, that's right, bitch. You're her. Were these guys fireflies? There are no fireflies anymore. Shut the fuck up. Answer the question. Where's Abby? I'm fucking dead anyway. Why would I tell you anything? Because if not, this pipe's going down your fucking throat. Yeah.
think about what he did. Shut the fuck up. How many people are dead because of him? Questions. I say we chop off her arm. The one not fucked up first. Oh well. You made your decision. Get her, Ellie. Get her. Bring out the fucking big ass fucking gardening tool. Oh, 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 oh yes. Get him. Yeah. Yes. Oh, I wish they showed it. I really do. Talking all this shit of my man Joel. Let's go. Clap back. I wish they showed it more. I really do. I, I full heartedly wish they showed it more. Fuck off with your talking all that shit. Show her face. Show her face fucking mushed in. Do it. I want you to. Oh no, she's at the theater. She's just like, hey, I'm home. Honey, I'm home. It's me. I pulled off the assassination mission. Honey, I'm home. I you're starting a family in the theater while I'm out getting shit done. A little bit, yeah. I got shot in the fucking shoulder. She's hiding out in the Unless it's where I am. Bitch got what she deserved. Bitch got everything she wanted. She wanted all the smoke. She got the fucking smoke. The chimney came in. Yikes. Wow. That is fucking bad. That's I think that's where she got shot with the arrow on the shoulder. Yeah, it's probably rubbing all the wounds with alcohol, right? I made her talk. Yeah, yeah, we fucking did. <laughs> we did. Don't feel bad about it, Ellie. <laughs> we, yeah, she talked the smoke. She got the smoke. This is for Joel. I don't give a fuck if we lose Ellie at this point. This is for Joel. Even if Abby and Ellie like kill each other at the end or something. Worth. Respect plus. Oh, two years earlier. St. Mary's. Sounds familiar. Is that the hospital where the fireflies are or what? Oh, there's spores up the wazoo. Is it, or is that just dust? Am I just stupid? Oh shit. Did she go back, like, on her own? No, let me see her face. She looks a lot different in, like, all the segments. Like, look, her face doesn't even look... Like, ah, I can't really see it. But it doesn't look as like round or chubby like it did like in the three years ago segment, right? Uh, my am I? I can't. I can't really tell. Shift door? <laughs> Is one of these a shift door? Yeah, they did. 
Medical supplies. Come on. Oh, it looks like empty boxes. Actually, that kind of looked like pairs of gloves. I mean, gloves are useful every now and then. A scale of some sort. Pumps. For blood pressure. Using it. They didn't all leave. They got massacred. Just, you know, FI. Oh, that's Ellie's mark, huh? The growth had clearly mutated. Let's see if this results corroborate our story. This is big. And so that's Ellie. That's results on Ellie. It looks like, or like you know, examinations on Ellie. So it looks like she came back by herself after the lie was told two years earlier. By this time tomorrow, we will have altered the course of history, Jay. That's the cordyceps in her brain, I'm assuming. The circled part. I tried activating my, uh, like getting out a gun or something, but it didn't work. Hold on, I think that might be the room where she was actually in, so. Nope, nothing else that I can see. Oh! Almost missed this! Let's see here. Don, you know, I'm glad I ca cataloged the, and collected all this rare hospital equipment. As, as soon as I'm done here, I hear that there's no use for it anymore. I cannot fucking believe you guys voted to disband. I get it. This was a miracle that slipped through our fingers. It's fucking shitty, but the whole world is shitty. How can we give up like this? What now? Settling QZs? Join some third re resistance groups? Fuck that. Someone still has to care. I'll spend the rest of my life trying to find them. Or die trying. Scott. Oh, was there a flip? No, no flip. So basically after the Joel incident, they decided to disband. And because, you know, that obviously was a huge blow to their research. And they lost, like... Oh god, something's in my eye. Uh, and they lost the top doctor, their leader, a bunch of, you know, recruits and stuff like that, so... They voted on disbanding, and some of them still wanted to try for something, but... They just couldn't. This was the room. This was the room. Is the dead doctor there? No, he's not. <laughs> they moved the body. Ah, cassette player, like a voice recorder. Okay, I see what they're getting at here. <sighs> so, consequently, from the actions in the first game of killing the leader, forcing them to disband, you know, getting rid of their top researcher slash doctor, whoever it was that was going to perform the surgery, right? And a bunch of their recruits and forces, they disbanded. And through disbanding, a lot of them or in a lot of different groups like hey let's go join blah let's go jo do this one subsection of the group Nora, Abby, Owen and I don't even know the rest of them I only know Nora because she was the most recent kill right oh and Bitch Scar they were all fireflies probably and they wanted to get payback on Joel for stopping the quote-unquote cure from happening 
even though like just think about it like common sense wise it's not guaranteed right if they like it's just not guaranteed that just because one person's immune you can like backwards engineer it and then like it could happen there's a high ass rate but there's also a rate of failure what if you fuck up the sample what if the sample gets contaminated what if you just can't you don't know how to reverse engineer it even if you're a top doctor right so there was no 120 percent it was gonna happen that we're gonna make the cure right at least from my opinion and just so what happened is they thought that they took their Joel by doing this took the cure away from them so that little subgroup of the fireflies wanted to kill Joel just because or not just because but because he had done that action of killing their leader having them disband and give essentially give up hope on finding a cure right and I think that's the angle they're gonna go with and they just found out that um what's it called they just found out that their Ellie just found out that Joel had lied because they said what if you know how are we gonna find another person that's a mutant when Joel had said there were dozens right so wow Okay, I'm gonna have to let that sit with me for a second, personally. Like, in terms of... Like, is it justifiable? Like, is it reasonable to to think that people like that would exist where, like, hey, you took away our cure and you want, you know, essentially, like, they think it was guaranteed to have a cure, so they want to hunt, man, hunt the guy down that did it? Yeah. Yeah, I can see that as reasonable and what, you know, something that they would want to do. I just, I don't know, I, I think I need to, I need to, I need to mull it over a little bit. Plus, we need to see how it plays out, you know, the rest of the story, so. Fuck. He looks a lot skinnier here. Is he gonna? If you love me one more time, I'm gone. You uh -oh. will never see me again. Uh oh. But if you tell me the truth, I'll go back to Jackson. No matter what it is. Come on, Joel, don't lie now. Fuck. Don't fucking touch me! 
Fuck. Now real quick, personally, I think that should have been a little bit more emotional. Like on Ellie's side, I think it was a great job displaying like the emotions that she would have felt from that. But it, like I feel like Joel, Joel should have been a little bit more emotional. You know, like hey, like they were gonna kill you. I couldn't let that happen. You know, something like that. That that would have got me. And if she would have still like done what she did right there and stormed off at the end or whatever, I. Fuck, that would have spent me, but I don't know. I, I think there could have been a little bit more emotion instead of just like monotone sternness from Joel right there. <laughs> so we'll be hunting down next. I kind of wish we could have fucked up more a little bit more. I'm not going to where they showed it or something. You know, huh? oh. That's easy. James. No. <laughs> oh, Curtis and Viper 4. Fuck. Fuck. Well, this place looks a lot different. I think we're in a different section or something. Dina? Jesse? James. Oh, playing card. I guess this wasn't the right way. Oh, it goes. Esquire. Whoa, what the fuck? Looks like a badass. Uh, Esquire, real name Gavin Arthur. Or Arthur. 60 brain, 60 brawn, for leash, and none. After losing his 10th murder trial, his former prosecutor decided he had gone through enough with the justice system. That night, he donned a costume and dispatched a defendant who hours earlier had walked free. Ooh. Now as Esquire, for any defendant that escapes justice, he exacts revenge equivalent to the crime. Oh, damn. Revi rev reviled? Reveled in the press and public as a lawless vigilante, but quietly praised by victims of the accused. He continues pursuing his versions of justice in the shadows. Neutral villain. I like that. Those are my favorite type of characters, right? The, you know... You got away from the system, but you can't get away from me, type people, you know? And I can see that as, like, a neutral villain, but... I also would like to... Like, I, I always say, like, those... They're perceived as neutral villains, right? Shouldn't they be viewed as, like, chaotic good? Because they're trying, you know, in their sense, in their brain, that's the good thing to do. And not only that... By others, by the victims, by people who agree with that mentality, like, personally, I myself would think, hey, if they fucking cheated or paid their way out of the system, you know, they should get what's coming to them, personally, you know, myself. And not everybody, you know, it depends on what they did. If you murdered a whole family for zero reason, like, literally zero reason, like, you were, like you were just on bath salts or something, hey, I think you should get a fucking penalty and not be able to plead, you know fucking, oh, it was a little bit crazy. Like, hey, what the fuck? Yeah, that's a little more than crazy, bud. Oh, guitar time?
I really want to see people make music from this. Like, I think it would be so cool to just, like, see someone playing with the fucking uh, PlayStation controller making, like, amazing fucking rhythms and songs with fucking, uh, you know, the touchpad. I think that would be so cool. I don't know, it's stupid, but I think it would be awesome. Let's see here. Looks impatient. Oh, he's watching over her sleep. You're gonna ask what's wrong or what? <laughs> By the way, finally some more cutscenes, right? And Abby, too. Gotta get her bitch ass. Cause that should be his kid, right? Like... Because us big strong individuals are gonna go clap some fucking cheeks right now. The long ass gun, what the fuck is that, a rifle? I still got the fucking pick. <laughs> So I've got a pickaxe on me still. <sighs> I've got a new teammate essentially, so that's good. Hmm. Did not make anything? Guess we're good on that front. Precision or explosions? Oh, that is tough. I guess technically if we make explosive arrows, isn't that like kind of having more ammo? Because more ammo would be kind of clutch. Oops. 
But aim stability increase, like, that's huge too, right? Move faster while aiming really isn't that good. Listen mode range is a whatever, it's alright, right? Hold the breath is good. Craft more arrows is good. So these two kind of meh. These are good. Oh shit, I keep doing that. This is good. This is great. That is great. This is good. I think I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna get both. I'm gonna get the aim stability increase just because that's huge, right? Like it's good for every gun. And then I'm gonna keep going with this. Yeah. Oh wow, we get three of them? It only takes binding and explosives. Oh no, we can have up to three. Damn. Alright, I'll do I'll do two though. Cause we're already maxed on these, so it's not that big of a deal. And then how do we So these are regular, these are explosive. Okay. Cool. And then I think it said our stability and accuracy are up 100%. Oh yeah, that's way less sway, right? Oh, that feels like way less sway at least. Hmm. All right, we're good to go. Come on. Help me okay, go for it. Shit. Okay. <laughs> Jeez, this is just outside the theater too. Thanks. Should we get to tell them about the uh, cultists? They were hoping to find Tommy at the aquarium. I didn't tell her you knew. That's what you're. I wasn't. <laughs> this aquarium a wolf face? I don't think so. Nora said. Abby's hiding out there. You get her to tell you why they did it. Yeah. Uh, <clears throat> Joel had uh, falling out with some fireflies. No, former fireflies. I fucking love this weapon, man. <laughs> it's like so big. I'm full on that for a minute. I should be using some rifle ammo. Nice. Hmm. I see a light through here. Oh, this was the correct way to go, apparently. Yeah. I didn't think it was. I thought it was straight ahead. Then I don't see the problem. What the fuck? If they, yo, they basically started a war, you know, like, there's no scenario in which, like, so J James is obviously like, oh, you know, he's trying to be cautious or trying to be like that little sub narrator that's like, revenge is bad, right? Like, we shouldn't be doing this anymore because they're gonna come back to us and it's gonna bite us back in the ass because of revenge, right? But it's like, they literally went out of their way to fucking get a little group of people to fuck with us. So they can fuck right off and we'll, uh, we'll fucking set up for war if we need to. Like, fuck this shit. Oh, 
I'm going to do a full out fucking war for my boy Joel. Let's treat him like that. Blow his knee off and then fucking hit him with a golf club like that. Mm -mm. And then proceed to talk all that shit like the Lord did? Nah, no, we don't let that shit fly around here, dude. That shit doesn't fly. Just like Ellie said, they started this shit, they can catch all the smoke. I'm out here looking like a chimney. Literally, like, no matter, like, even with that, so, like, back to one of my reasons, right? Like, even though they took away, like, you can say that Joel took away their hope and their big organization to which they all belong to to strive for hope, right? He literally saved your fucking life. You would not be breathing without Joel having saved Abby. And Abby still went out and took, the, like, did that to him? Like, are you fucking serious? Are you really fucking that fucking serious? I just gotta ask. Like, that's not, that's not something you do. Like, yeah, okay, like... Oh my god. Like, that's just... He literally just saved your life, and you do that shit to him, man. Why didn't she tell me about the pregnancy? Listen, I, I'm sure she'll tell you about it when she... Like, you could say whatever you want about everything else, but that part just doesn't fly with me. The, fa the fact that Joel literally saved her life from, like, how many ever walkers, right, with Tommy. And they still beat the shit out of Tommy and knock him unconscious and then kill Joel the way that they killed Joel. Abby would literally be fucking dead. She would have died right there had it not been for the smuggler that took away her, her hopes of finding a cure. Which wasn't guaranteed by the by. I thought he was an enemy. Guys, really suck at your job, don't you? You suck on this. Sorry, I was rubbing my eyes real quick. Uh, let's go fucking kill him. Get out of the way. Where are they? Oh, I heard the thing, but... Are you fucking serious right now? Nah, fuck you. Where's the other one? I know there's another one. Alice? Alice is dead. -ish. Yeah, fucking will. Say that again. So triggering. I know, right? there's gonna be something in a uh, that room right there the teller stuff not sure I just have a feeling uh, should I swap it's five for what five uh, I guess I'll take this excuse me wow that was big belch sorry guys like I, said, I can't really fucking mute the um 
I'm like I'm really sorry about that. But um, yeah. In case I decide to upgrade this uh melee weapon. You know, it'll have more charges, or it has the capacity to have more charges. Okay, I think we're good. Excuse me. Let's see here. Yeah, personally, that shit just doesn't fly with me, though. The, like I was saying, the, um, the whole, oh, we came all the way out here for revenge, but it's like, he literally saved your life right then and there. Over what? A possibility, so you killed him over what? A possibility of getting a vaccine, albeit a good poss possibility of getting a vaccine. And fucking, because you have a grudge against this guy, because of that he took away your possible vaccine? Like, I don't know, man. Just, that just feels so fucking BM to me and doesn't process personally to me. It's a bunch of comics. Wait, what's happening here? Gathering for people who are really into this stuff. Like you, basically. We were born in the wrong time, man. I say that shit to myself all the time. I wish I was a part of like the 30, 40s. But I mean, I heard someone say, I don't remember who it was. But someone tell, told me, like, the past is always romanticized, right? Like, oh, it was always a better time, and yada yada. But I truly do feel like those times were really the better times. Like, they, it was just, it was so cool. The look was awesome, that retro shit, and it's, ah, I just, I always thought, like, and people were polite back then, you know? People knew what their roles were for the most part, and they did them. Um, Without much complaint. I'm not talking about like any gender biases or anything. I just mean like, hey, if you were in a family of delivery men, you were probably going to end up being a delivery man or whatever. And then you just get into that with your pa and grandpa and you run a business or be a part of a business. You know, and I thought that that's just cool. That's family owned stuff. Traditional stuff. Like, I really dig that shit. Oh, I thought he was a fucking clicker or something. I was about to start popping. Let's see, you know. Where are we going? Is that the aquarium? That Ferris wheel shit? Look at this mess. I said it's about the coast. It's right next to that Ferris wheel. Yep. This whole thing Tommy has the same info. We have no idea what info Tommy has. Tommy's been beating the shit out of people from what we know. That's about it. Yes, sir. Way ahead of you. That's gross. This fucking like algae or whatever the fuck. That's nasty. Cool. That was simple. Come on. Jesse James, let's go. Oh shit. I slipped in. <laughs> fuck. Mm, like a wonder possibly? Let's see. Yep, they're supposed to move. Uh, let me check over here. I feel like there's gonna be like a collectible or something. No, I thought there would be. Guess not. On it. <laughs> oh shit. I actually didn't want to fall there. Son of a gun. Son of a gun. <laughs> Think you can get through there? Let's see. 
Let us see, boyo. Oh, I thought he was gonna fucking pop up because he turned solid for a second. For real. Uh oh. These are people, people. They're not zombies. Let's get back to the street. Yeah. Put the wet fuck, man. People must have not died that long ago then. Blood's still fucking wet. Cool, I needed one. Um, I don't know exactly how to get the fuck out of here. Um... I'm assuming we- oh, that way maybe? Wait, that's where we came from, right? We dropped in from over there. I'm trying to get back on the street and that would be that way, I would assume. But there's nowhere to get over there unless we're going off this ledge, but there's nowhere to stand on. Oh, we're just dropping down. Well, it's over thought it. I wonder if there's anything over here. Hmm. Some supplements. Take those. Guess supplements ain't bad, right? Take those any day of the week. Cool, we already have enough for uh, improved blast radius. Cool, cool, cool. Next is improved Molotovs, which is also huge. Molotovs is mostly like for infected and then bombs and shit, I said. Would, I say it would be for people. Is this the right way or is this the wrong way? This is the right way. Where's the dog? Where are they? I can't really see them. Hear the fucking clan clicking, or the can clicking. I mean, see, like they're right there, but I can't really see them. See them. Oh shit! That was the wrong one. <laughs> I didn't mean to <laughs> use it. God, on my ass, I knew it! <laughs> Fuck the dog. 
Oh, I feel like a scumbag, but it had to be done. That's probably not gonna die, so it looks like we're good. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Can I actually run past a lot of the segments in this game, which I've been doing? One, because I'm too anxious, two, because I have minimum supplies, right? Oh, that's fucking weird. Mannequin statues or whatever the fuck. So that was a WLS. It looked like they found a, uh, uh, what do you call them? A Seraphite Straggler. Could be. That's, I mean, that's a good strat, right? That shit's still pretty far out. Oh, look at the convoy. See that shit? Oh, we use that. Mm hmm. A boat? Yeah, a boat. That's better. Where are they at? How are we gonna snag this bitch, right? They're gonna pop out somewhere soon, or? Let's try through here. So what's the plan? We take these guys out and steal their boat. Definitely taking their boat. It's up to them if they want to get in our way. <laughs> hopefully, it's a small crew. It didn't look like more than three people, from what I saw, anyway. So hopefully. Excuse me. Oh shit! There's something here. Oh, I oh, know. Yeah, there we go. I knew it was something else behind besides alcohol. Which, by the way, real quick. Okay. Fuck, we should have, uh... Uh, we should have waited and took, took the alcohol. They have five arrows, so I don't really want to make a... thing right now, silencer. We could, right? Oh, we just got another bottle part, so I think I have. Uh, put it on if we need to put it on. Ooh. I thought there was a way to pop up my head right there. Maybe there were going to be even more supplies, but there were not. Ooh, a blank card. Top. Tatuaje. Tattoo. <laughs> uh, Tatuaje, real name, Salvador Ramos. Brain 60, Bronze 60, affiliation none. Teenager Salvador Ramos was bullied mercilessly by his peers, culminating a prank where they lured him out to an ancient mountain tomb and closed him inside. Alone and scared, Sal stumbled across a mysterious cliff depicting the Mayan deity Akat. Upon touching it, his snake tattoo came to life and guided him home. Now known as Tatuaje, his body is covered with tattoos of weapons, animals, everything he needs to seek vengeance against those who wronged him. But a cop demands a new tattoo every lunar cycle upon pain of upon pain of death. And Tatuaje is running out of space. So what, it feels like he's dying? Every time he gets a tattoo? Hmm, that's that's like a cool, interesting little like you know character thing. It's kind of it's kind of sick. <laughs> I'm trying. I'm like imagining that as like a My Hero Academia quirk. I think it's pretty badass. Pretty OP, you can get anything on you too, right? Um, 
We're snorkeling and endorkeling. Oh shit. Not what we grab onto. Well, I guess he had to go first. Um, or not? Okay, yeah, that's kind of weird. Thomas Flynn. Like their Tom Hill figure or whatever. Hello, sir. That boat looks very nice. <laughs> so. Get to the marina through here. Are you fucking serious? I mean, she's like completely right. Why would he stick around there to uh, to get caught, right? If there's a sniper, like I guess that sniper that they were talking about was Tommy. But it's like if he's he's smart and we all know he is, right? Then fucking he's not gonna stay there and get fucked. something about like do you think this affects the raid tonight raid where raid on the seraphites there is no cabin there is no cabin <laughs> Where? Behind me. It's not Gavin, I told you, he's dead. Like, how do they know? Like, to an extent, yeah, I get it. I left some bodies out, but... They should really let you drag bodies like some fucking hitman shit, you know? Oh, or, uh... I just noticed our silencer's fucking blue. That's cool. I like it.
I mean, like, I don't really want to. But it looks like we might have to, um... Might have to up our... Uh, what do you call it? Our hearing. Because it's just, like... There's just almost no fucking way that we can see, like, all these people with the base level one shit, right? I saw something. No, you didn't. Yes, you should, dude. Jumping across. What's up, bud? How's it going, buddy? There was someone down there. I know there was. It wasn't him. Three damn snacks right there. So can I just take the bow? Like I've just been wasting my time. I think I've just been wasting my time. I think we're gonna just on the boat. Someone over there on the left. Can I get up on this? Are you fucking kidding me? Now we gotta go over there. Oh, wreck. This is where I slaughtered all those people. <laughs> we were coming up one by one by one, right? Man, it looks like we have to go left, because left is where the boat is. the baba buoy right. is spread out let's go man yeah so these are the last two it looked like after I'd gotten everyone else uh, nice shotgun shell dude that's huge mm, oh, okay So it kind of... Oh, okay. Ooh! 
<laughs> nice. Kind of drives a little like a warthog from Halo with the thumbsticks. Except the thumbstick is how you move. I don't remember if that's how you drive a warthog, but yeah, the thumbstick is how you move. Can't be it. Oh. In here? Over oh, like that? I'll just tell me where the boat is, okay. Ooh, this is some flies, nice. Bunch of bullets too, we really needed those. Cool. That's cool. Oop. Put on our hood in the rain, nice touch. So she said I think I can go over that. I guess she's meaning this gate. Like this part that's just like fucking fucked up. Oh. Yep. Okay. Please go through. Yeah, I was gonna say, can I look at where I'm going at least? Shit. <laughs> uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh god. <laughs> Jesus. Now what? Oh, okay. This place is like walkable. There's gotta be some button here that we can press. Something, right? Oh wow. Is this a or something? Beth, if you're reading this and I'm toast, I hope it wasn't those scar fuckers but some but some blaze of glory. Bigger hope is you remember where we hit stash. Code is seventy twelve sixty four. It's not much, but it's all I have. I want you to take it be well, Randall. Damn. Randall got put down. Ferris wheel? Yeah, Ferris wheel. It's not that far anymore. Um, Abby, I begged you to stop. You brought this on yourself. That's right. That's right. We did tell her to please stop. We even added the please. Oh, okay. It says, hold on. What I know, they're former fireflies from the hospital. It makes sense. It's what my gut said all along. The WLF is a bunch of took a bunch of them in after they disbanded they traveled to Jackson specifically to kill Joel to torture Joel killing him wasn't enough Abby's hiding out in the aquarium what I don't know why is Ivy heading out does it matter where are the rest of them does it matter if that if I get Abby no where's Tommy is he still alive he has to be should I tell Dinah and Jesse about this no they can't know what Joel did they won't understand do I understand yes it's pretty straightforward he didn't want to lose you and obviously you understand because you're fucking coming out and exacting revenge, right? Which I dig, personally. Fuck them. It's what they fucking get. Especially after that bitch talks shit. Again, I'm gonna bring that shit up. He talked all that mad shit. Then when the time came for her to take, you know, talk, take the smoke. She didn't want it. All the, oh, please don't kill me. Oh, yeah. Get the fuck out of my face. Honestly. Shit pissed me the fuck off. Talking that shit and then running away like a little bitch. Okay. Glad Nora got what she Where's fucking it? got. There are roaches. Ew. Ew, it's a bunch of roaches. Ew. Yes. Ew. Oh, was a safe. Uh, I forgot the combination already. Give me one second. Let me loot the shit out of this place. 
Looks like there should have been tools there. Oops, that's not it. Stash note. Yeah, the one, the one that I didn't get, the one with the two shamblers in that bar, or, or the one where I got the precision manual, maybe, I did not give a fuck about that safe, unless that safe gave me, like, 500 spare parts, and, like, 300 pharmaceuticals, I did not give a fuck. 70, 12, 64. <sighs> 70... Twelve sixty four. Nice. What do they got? Let's see. Seven tools, alcohol, two shotgun shells, huge, seventeen pharmaceuticals, and two revolver rounds. Let's go. That was a good one. That was an amazing one. Fuck yeah. Save shotgun shells for shamblers is probably what I'm gonna do, right? Shamblers are a huge problem, man. And I've only ever seen them come in like fucking twos, which is ridiculous. These fuckers are tanky. And without, you know, that flashback segment, we haven't run into the one that has, like, armor plating on him, where he throws the spores and shit, so... I'm sure that's gonna pop up, too, in the game. All this nice little how to fucking open the damn door. Oh my god, it's right here. I'm stupid. Okay, I know what we have to do, I think. So I'm thinking... Let's see. No, uh, there's a big ass, like, barbed thing, or like that fucking thing in the way, so I don't know actually. Right here. Yeah. Because I was thinking we put this back and then it'll get over there because of the flood. Is there something else we can move there? Because the boat's not really moving, so we have to get something else, right? Hmm. Well, this doesn't exactly push us down, so... Hmm. Oh, I just have to make you go all the way up. Wow, I'm fucking dumb. I am fucking dumb. Okay, that works. Oh shit. This game has a lot of accessibility options, which is awesome, right? Let's put it out. I thought it was going to be some type of jump scare, but I guess not. Good. Good, good, good. I 
That place kind of looked like I could go on it. Hold on. What? Oh, the workbench. Nice. Hmm. Here we go. Speed reloader, baby. Oh, wow. Okay, so I didn't even read the description. It's all bullets in at once now instead of just one of them. That's fucking awesome. That's perfect. That's cool. Nice. Just making sure there's nothing in here. Alright, let's go. Good that I got the upgraded though. Oh, some parts. Um, actually... Thinking about... I have 36, right? I could get the, uh, the other one. The fire rate. Might as well. Place the hammer. Nice. It's a slicker hammer. <sighs> Just need one more. The stability, right? It's like rubbing off the grip. Replace your revolver grip to reduce recoil and increase weapon sway. Or decrease weapon sway. Yep. So we need another 44, 44 more parts and then we can finally get that side challenge I set for myself of upgrading the revolver all the way. Julio, Julio. I mean it's open worldish, but not really because it's just like there's like one thing for you to do plus uh oh I'm out get y'all yeah there's like one thing for you to do along with uh Jeez. along with the place that you're supposed to go uh oh I'm assuming we have to go there This is for to be honest. It's not necessarily like the longest rope, right? Oh, 
man, I fucked up. Oh my god. Oh shit, there's another one. Oh, what do I do? Oh. Towers? Oh shit. Come oh, on, man. <sighs> okay. Looks like a W will uh, bear fight altercation. Oh wow! Fuck you, man. Oh come on! This man's got a arm like fucking Tom Brady out here. My boat is on fire. Hell. The water was somehow on fire. That was kind of funny. Come on, Ellie. Gotta go. Fuck you guys. Can we just go through? Yes, we fucking can. Oh, didn't even need to waste the ammo on them, really. I'm sure there were collectibles that we missed out on, but... That's the place we came in from, wasn't it? Oh, I guess not. Oh. What? I was gonna say, like, boats more powerful than glass, for fucking sure. Damn. WMB Arcade's annual Fright Nights. Anyone in costume gets 100 tickets free. Special rewards on Halloween night. Edible Heat Horrors. Most beautiful con uh, costume contest. Spooktacular prizes. September 20th to October 21st. 8 p.m. to midnight. Used a lot of uh, my sniper rounds there, even though I didn't need to. Apparently, that fucking sucks. I could have just ran by. Mm -hmm. Supplement, rag, nothing else it looks like. Ski ball, cool. Place looks cool. It's like a little diner slash bar. Has some bolts like tabletop games. Arcade machines, like this place looks awesome. There's some uh, some tools in the ticket dispenser. It doesn't look very big. Of course, the lights aren't on, so it doesn't have that same feel. But oh shit, yeah, this man is fucked up. Is that a reptar? I know escape. Dance, dance. The turning. Oh shit, she doesn't mention anything about it though this time. Explosives. Assuming the door is locked and we have to get up there. Oh shit. Oh fuck me. And speaking of the big guy, right?
No, what? The end is a guy? Are you fucking serious right now? What the fuck? Dude, I was trying to trade their change over to my shotgun like over and over and it just would not. Damn. I, I told you man, I told you guys that fucker was coming. I told you this man was gonna pop up. I didn't think it'd be like that. But I really wanted to use the shotgun like I was saying but Game was actually trolling the fuck out of me. What is it? Oh, like I can move the card if it was upside. Lol. <sighs> it's so fucking annoying. I kept trying to do it, and it would uh, like it, it would just do that, or it would like fucking not do it because you have to hold it. And it's like, wait, but I'm in a tense situation. I can't just stand here holding the damn thing. How was that? Ooh, cool, I like it. Surprise, Senna. Trading card. Tascan Bright trading card. Oh. Let's see here. Kazuka Bright, home planet Titan, brains 100, brawn 40, affiliation spark. Orphaned by the Civil War on Titan, young Kazuka Bright vowed revenge on a future alliance whom he had held responsible for initiating the conflict. Growing up to become a renowned communication engineer, Engineer for Spark Century 22, he developed quantum signaling technology that allowed for co instant communication across vast distances. Though it gave Spark an advantage, they still suffered defeat after defeat against the Future Alliance, boosting his quantum communicator for to, to reach far beyond our star system. Casca now tries to contact someone or something capable of helping him seek revenge. Neutral villain. Hmm, I'm wondering like maybe um, the superhero cards are kind of like a way to say like these actions are justified and these actions are not right like so the vigilante seeking justice for himself was a neutral villain right people or the guy the, the guy with the tattoos that wanted to do anything uh, you know to get the guys that wronged him and shoved them in the temple in the first place I think he was a villain as well this guy wants revenge for the thing that started the conflict he was a villain right I think that's what they're trying to nail home they're trying to be like hey revenge is bad even with the playing card I think that's what the correlation is in the story now it's trying to say like even with these motives that you might relate to even with these motives that you think are justified you're still at the end of the day an antagonist and I think that's what they're trying to drive home with them and so I mean some of them I would agree yeah but I, I feel like it all depends on context right you can't just say because you want revenge for um, something bad that happened to you you're a villain right what if you're like let's say the Punisher right the Punisher in the original fucking who what was his name uh, the the old one the 2000 one right uh, I forgot the actor's name not Pierce Brosnan. What the fuck is his fucking name? Hold on, let me look it up. Uh, Punisher Actor 2000. I think it's 2000. I don't know what it was made. Uh, John Travolta. There we fucking go. The John Travolta Punisher, right? His entire family is fucking murked in front of him, right? They're on vacation on some island. They're all chilling. They're having a good time. And they're all just fucking murders, and some of them in brutal fucking ways, right? So what does he do? He goes out, and he hunts them all. And he gets the leader, and he drags his fucking body... Oh, spoilers, by the way. He drags his fucking body across the fucking... Uh, across, like, a parking lot, forging his Punisher symbol. And it's a fucking amazing movie, if you guys haven't seen it. Great-ass fucking revenge flick. Funny. Uh has a bunch of amazing, you know, 2002-2004 action scenes. It's super good, right? I totally recommend it. I showed it to my roommates who were like, 
in love with the the new Punisher, right? The um, the fucking the Shane Punisher from The Walking Dead, and even they were like, I was I was hyping it up. I was hyping saying the original Punisher is so fucking good. You guys gotta watch it. And they were like, yeah, right, whatever, blah blah blah. But eventually, we I got them to watch it because it was like on TV randomly, and they all loved it. Like they thought it was great. And it's just like. I feel like that has nothing to do with the point I was making, but the point I'm making is that scenario in which those things happen in the movie, that shit's justified as fuck. And he goes out and he kills everybody that killed his entire fucking family, and that's it. That's the end of it. It was an amazing movie, and I feel like he was justified. Like, I just, maybe it's a personal thing, maybe it's an opinion thing, right? Is it justified, is it not justified? But I personally think that context matters. And then something like this, something like this, it kind of makes it worse too because the way that I see it, right? Two years ago, Ellie found out what Joel did. It's not like she doesn't know what Joel did and why he may have or may have not gotten fucking tortured and killed like that. But now we know Ellie knew. Ellie fucking knew and she's still out here vibing for her boy, right? Wanting revenge for Joel, even though he took away the one thing that she really wanted too, which was to matter. She wanted her immunity to matter, and she took that from him. Or he took that from her, my bad. And still, she's out here trying to get revenge for him because she loves him, and you know, she protect or he protected her, and he essentially started raising her from the time on that uh that they spent together. So it's just like, if anything, that makes it worse for the fact, uh, or like, more viable for the fact that she wants revenge and it's, in my opinion, justified that she wants revenge. Oh, fuck. And that shouldn't make you a villain for wanting revenge. Yeah, I get it. The fucking endless cycle of violence, but at the end of the day, what they did was entirely fucked up. And so actions like that shouldn't go unpunished. Shit. Another way of coming to eat my ass, it is. <laughs> fuck. How the fuck am I? Oh. Oh lord, he coming. All of a sudden, the waves are miraculously stop. Don't worry. Let's pull out the Joel revolver for this one. If this is where we end fucking Abby, I want to do it with the Joel revolver. Actually, you know what? Give me the iron. Give me the fucking, give me the fucking putter. Okay. Give me the fucking putter, let's go. Okay, where are you? Give me that, what do they call it, the nine iron? Give it to me. I want to use the same shit. I'm like, whoa. Man, fuck that bitch. Binding, the binding of Isaac. No, oh, it's another. Uh, oh yeah, it's an aquarium. I believe. <laughs> I forgot it was an aquarium for some reason. Go through here. It's like little. They're restricting our speed. It looks like. Not by a lot, but enough, right? I don't know. A meth lab or something? Like, what? Like. Realistically, it's probably like some water filtration system, but I have no idea. You know. This is cool. I always liked aquariums. Sea scares me, though, you know. It's, I can't swim personally, so. Some of the animals look really cool from there, though. 
It's so wild how like we live on Earth and like you know they have that th that saying or whatever. It's like oh yeah you know blah 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 percent of the Earth is water, but we don't fucking know anything about the water. It's like or like we've only explored a certain percent of the water. And it's just like Jesus, man, it's fucking insane. Well, this place looks pretty fucking vacant, so I have no fucking idea. It's not like there was one story that was, you know, magically lit up or some shit, you know? Excuse me. Oh, some pharmaceuticals and parts, huh? What's that? More parts? Hey. Looks like it's gotta be from there, but I don't know. Hmm. Oh, I just saw the light shimmering. Yeah, we're probably gonna end the session after a little bit. I've been playing for like three hours. I've been like so, uh, what do you call it? Of course. Um, so, not concerned. What's the word? Immersed. So immersed. Oh, oh shit! Was Abby's dog? I got Fido. I'm from. I don't want to hurt the dog to fuck this dog if it's Abby's. Here's a light. God. She's trading herself, I assume. Fuck happened here. Oh. Must have gotten shot or something, right? Maybe she pulled it out and lost some blood. Can't tell which is the way what's the way to go. I'm gonna save real quick. It's been a minute since I saved. The last time I like manually saved was the um the place with the seraphites. This is more than one person. This isn't just Abby, yeah, this isn't just fucking Abby like they said. Maybe it's Abby and Owen, yep, Owen Moore. Yep. And he was a firefly. Oh, what was that? Owen Moore. Can't wait to kill all these fuckers. it seems like either I don't know whether this is the right way or this is the right way right the crap sounds like they're past there hold on got the Joel revolver ready Locked. okay there we go Looks like this might be it.
<laughs> That's right, bitch. That's fucking right. Let's go. You don't, bitch. You're right. Bullshit. Yeah, she doesn't give a fuck about her. She'll sell her out. Fuck back, bitch. Point where she is. Fucking oh shit! Yeah! Let's fucking go! Fuck you! Hey, you too, bitch! You want the smoke? Nah, nah, we matching square hard today, boys. Uh oh! Spaghettios. <laughs> Fuck yeah, bitch. Oh, you're still alive. Oh. Oh, you're still. Oh, you're still alive. Something about bring. You said something she, and then something something bring. Well, you stabbed her in the neck. I don't think she's alive. Oh, yeah. In the beginning of the game, they mentioned someone was pregnant, huh? Oh, maybe they said baby. Oh, you almost shot Tommy. Wow, but James was right. It was him, I guess. This might be a hot take. But I don't give a shit that she was pregnant. <laughs> I don't give a fuck. You were a part of it just as much as all of them. I don't give a shit. I don't think Ellie should feel bad. Again, I don't see why you would feel bad. Fuck him. Yes, the parallel that Dinah's pregnant and she was pregnant and... Oh, what if they did that to Dinah? Yeah, I honestly don't give a shit. I really don't. <laughs> like... I'm in this for the revenge haul, baby. Fuck them. You were a part of it at all, you're getting the fucking knife in your neck. I don't give a fuck if you're pregnant, I don't give a fuck if you're living back a family. We're killing you. We're killing you. Just just a revenge hot take, personally. That's just how I feel. I don't know about you guys, but that's just how I feel. This is like the the makeup place for the uh the plays, huh? And we'll do this little dialogue or whatever of leaving the uh, theater, probably with Tommy and James right here, because she was passed out or too tired or whatever. And then, um, that's gonna be it for today's stream. I've been playing for three hours. And I mean, to be fair, it was a fun three hours. It was really fun. I did enjoy myself, and I love these revenge kills. These revenge kills are cool. And they feel good. You kill Abby. What the fuck you mean, some air?
They got what they deserved. They did. I don't feel bad. Why the she fuck do you feel bad? bad? Who gets to live? Abby? True, true. I do want to cap Abby. No, no, she doesn't. Is that okay? No, not at all. It's the whole reason we came out here for her. Well, for all of them, but her too. Mm. I'm really not looking forward to going through Idaho again. What you should be worried about is what Maria's going to do to you. Got his ass. However, when I was passing through some ritzy section of town, I come across this necklace. It sparkles a lot. I think it's real gold. You think it's real gold? It's real gold. <laughs> I know what gold looks like. If it's the bro, <laughs> find your own damn bribes. <laughs> well. Two bitches today. Fuck them. They got what they do deserve. Same. My friends can't get out of their own damn way. It's better. Hmm. Oh, the fuck? Took out Tommy? What the fuck? Get out of here. Stand up now. Don't you fucking dare. Shut the fuck, up. fuck that. We kill her now. We no. kill her now. No, we kill her now. Toss your weapon. No. Toss your weapon. Why? She's gonna kill the both of you. He did what he did to save me. There's no cure because of me. I am the one that you want. Just let him go. You killed my friends. Good. That's what they fucking deserve. I feel like you both live. And you wasted it. Kill her. Kill her. So we're getting Abby flashbacks now, is that it? Four years earlier. Alright. Well I said I would do that. And then we'd end the stream, so we're gonna do that and then we're gonna end the stream. Damn! Leave it on the cliffhanger. Well I am definitely gonna be playing tomorrow at least two hours hopefully. I really want to get through this, see how the story is, right? So, fuck. Man, we left on such a cliffhanger, though. Like, <sighs> fucking Abby um, kills Jesse, it looks like. I don't know. It looked like he got shot in the collar, but we couldn't really see, right? Um, so, uh, presumptively kills Jesse. Um... She's got Tommy at gunpoint and you now because you made a dumb decision of throwing away your fucking weapon. Like, I would have taken the trade, personally. That's just me. Not trade of like, oh, Tommy for me killing her. I would have taken the trade like, she's obviously going to try to defend herself and try to like pull up the gun at me. So, I would take the trade of the one for one possibility, personally. Um, so yeah, it's going to end the stream for today. Um, hopefully you guys enjoyed. If you did on twitch.tv forward slash some hot cookies, uh, just hit a follow at the very least, please. <laughs> and, uh, if you're on youtube.com, some hot cookies channel, then hit a like, dislike, whichever you prefer, subscribe, 
and comment your favorite part. My favorite part, getting fucking revenge. Killing all the assholes who deserve to be killed. IMO, that's just me. You know, personally, I like the revenge thing. Shtick. Plus, they deserve it, IMO. For any participation they had in Joel's demise slash torture. Fuck them. Um, yeah, and then, uh, if you want to keep up with me, details in the stream. Uh, one VODs or highlights are going live on YouTube.com. Follow me over on uh, Twitter, at SoMyPickies. I'll be sure to post when all that stuff goes live. So, uh, without further ado, right? I guess we shall see you guys next time. Hope to see you there.